Hi friends, welcome back. Today I am working on week 35 in my 2023 Project Life album. I didn't have a lot of time for this week, so it's going to be really quick and really simple. I've just gone back to uh, my favorite um, older kit from Studio Calico. I love this one because it's super bright and colorful, and to be honest, it was on the top of the pile, <laughs> so I grabbed that out. I thought the blue card with the, I don't know what sort of cats they're supposed to be, but the leaping cats on the top would be perfect for my title card this week. Um, I've got a, a screenshot. It's not really a photo. I've got a screenshot from uh, Love Island. That's our latest TV watch, uh, which is bright blue. My cookie photo looks kind of blue. The blue worked nicely. Uh, and then I'm going to add a few extra little colors in here. Not as many as maybe I usually would because the photos were quite colorful and I thought to balance it out I would add something a little bit more subtle so I've got it it is actually like a yellow star kind of a golden star pattern under the top photo with pearl um, and the red hearts on the white background had to for Love Island um, and then I just added a little uh, like a quote card down the bottom I'm not going to do any journaling it was kind of a Kind of a busy week, kind of a fun week, just kind of a really basic week. So I don't feel like I'm missing out by not putting a bunch of journaling in there. I do kind of journal elsewhere a lot of the time, so my notes kind of go in there. Uh, as far as embellishments go, I'm just going to try and keep things a little bit simpler. I've got another one of those plastic hearts again. I thought it would be a nice way to use... Uh, or to add a little bit of color onto the black and white photo of the two kittens. This was kind of one of the first times that we'd really caught them like sleeping together. Um, now they do it all the time, but I remember back then I was so excited to be able to sneak a photo. I didn't quite get them in time. You can see Pearl's looking at me like, what are you doing, you crazy lady taking a photo? Uh, but they were sleeping together. So the red heart, and it, although they're plastic, it actually does like retain quite a lot of its like opacity with the color and I, I really liked that because I did want to add a little bit of color in there. I'm going to add a little bit more because I'm going to put some of these little puffy sticker and they're kind of like starbursts, just a couple of those. Well, there's three actually. And I'm going to use the alpha that was in the kit. I can't use it for a title card anymore because there are no E's left. Um, I'm going to try and make some other words or actually both of them end up being kind of noises rather than words I'm just gonna spell out R because that's how I felt I love the yellow on the red it really stands out nicely and adds a whole bunch of color into a black and white photo which is which is kind of good uh, I decided to add a little puffy sticker on here and I am going to end up going back and adding in some alphas as well. I'll use those that same kind of thing and end up putting yum on there. But for now, I'm just going to stick down my screenshot and add a puffy sticker. I will end up adding another puffy sticker. I only added one at this point because I couldn't see the other heart. I was hoping that there was going to be more than one heart and I only saw one. Um... So I only added one, but now when I'm placing these other little starbursts on my other photo of Pearl, I realized, no, there are two hearts on here. So I'm going to pop that into there as well. So Pearl's little photo was pretty simple. I added a little chipboard. I've got a real heart theme going on in here. Uh, and those same starbursts again, just to add a little bit of extra color. And this is when I decided to go back and I'm going to spell out the word yum. Uh, it doesn't stand out as much on the cookie photo as it does on that red heart but I'm still okay with it it actually shows up more in real life than it does here on camera uh, I'm pretty much done except for a title card so I am going to put that together just really really simply I'm going to use another chipboard shape I've used two already on here uh, I did kind of think before I stuck that down, I will need something to do some of my stamping on. So I'm going to add a label. This is just a digital label. It's actually one of my freebies from my Patreon. Um, kind of the perfect red in there. So I've just tucked that under the chipboard and I'm going to date stamp on top of that one. I'm going to use the alpha stamp that was in the kit to stamp out the word week. There are no numbers on the stamp set and I didn't really want to um, 
stamp out the entire word or, or phrase week 35. Uh, so as I'm stamping, I'm kind of thinking of an alternative and actually I'm just going to dive back into my stash uh, of alphas, well, and numerals, I guess. I wanted to find an alpha set that had numerals. I wanted it to be black just to kind of tie in with everything else. I didn't want to add another color up here onto the title card. Uh, and I wanted it to be a little bit larger. So the cluster that I've got here is, it's quite small in comparison to the four by six card. So I wanted something a little bit larger just to kind of balance that out. I've got these citrus twist alphas, which are perfect. So I'm going to pop my week 35 on there. And I was wondering about a puffy sticker. I saw this kind of, again, mis miscellaneous leopardy looking cat. Thought, why not? We've got a couple cat photos on there. We've got a cat heavy theme. I'm going to pop that in there. It finished off my little cluster perfectly. Uh, and that was my week. So all in all, done in less than 20 minutes. And that's my kind of week. Hey, thanks for watching today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you want to keep watching, I'm going to leave a couple videos on screen. Otherwise, I'll see you again really soon. Bye.